What's going on TW fans? Jake here, giving you this week's episode of What's New at Tackle Warehouse. Summertime's getting here. We got some ledge fishing stuff. Uh, we got some boat accessories in case you're just rigging up your boat right now. Uh, you know, first things first, if you need a new shirt for this summer, you need to check out all the stuff we just got from Salty Crew. Today, I'm wearing the new Pond Donkey shirt. Sweet shirt, super comfortable, 100% cotton, and it's got this awesome graphic of this airborne bass with like a top water in its mouth. Also got a full size logo on the back. So make sure you check out all the new gear that we just got from Salty Crew. So if you're at home, you know, you're rigging up your boat, accessorizing things, making sure, you know, your boat's real dialed in. We just got a bunch of new gear from Ashmore Marine. So we got a full line of products. We got this little line spooling device right here. And then we got a bunch of things like, uh, you know, slotted tool bar. We got slotted bait bars. So, you, you know, put your baits, tools, and things like that on there. We got this little cup for your trolling motor. So put this up on your front deck so that little arm of your trolling motor slides in there so you're not smashing any of your rod butts. Uh, we got cable organizers. This one right here is made for a Minn Kota trolling motor so you can organize the, the your transducer cables on your trolling motor. So get rid of all the zip ties and keep everything nice, neat, organized. We got things like this. We got this Humminbird 360 degree transducer mount stabilizer. So if you have a 360 imaging, you got that extra transducer arm, you know, attached to the trolling motor. This just keeps it stabilized. So if you're running across really rough water, if it's summertime and there's tons of boat out on the lake and you're bouncing and that arm, you know, that arm is going up and down, this is going to hold it in place and prevent any kind of damage to your 360 imaging. All right, so the baits we got today. So the first one up, not really a new bait, one that we used to carry a long time ago. We, we didn't have it for a while, now we finally just got it back. So we got the Bogerman buzz baits back in stock. So it's iconic buzz bait. It's been around for years. They catch tons of fish, they're really well built. They got the big blade on there that clacks the head as it spins, so you get a lot of noise. You can tune it if you want to too. You can bend the arm out and, and stretch that blade away from the head if you want a little bit more toned down of a sound. You don't want that head clacking. But you know, all around is great components. Got that keeled head shape, gets up on plane really quick. It's got a wire keeper on there, so if you want to put a trailer on there of some type, it'll hold it on there really well. Really stout hook on there. I think the first buzzbait I ever got was a Bogerman buzzbait, so we're stoked that we got these back in stock. All right, next up from Magnum Baits, we got the new Worms or Worm. So th this is built by some guys up at the California Delta, and they originally built this bait for, you know, punch shotting and power shotting, that type of technique. It's a super unique worm. It's got a really solid head design, and then it comes down and it has this, this kind of spade-like tapered tail. So, you know, it gets a lot of tail action, and then on the underside of it, it actually has a channel so that you can rig it up with, a, with like an EWG style hook or, um, you know, just a Texas rigging style hook, and you're gonna get a little bit better hook penetration. It's loaded down with garlic and salt, so you can do a ton of different things with this. You can fish it weightless if you want. Um, like I said, it's made for punch shotting, power shotting. It's be great on a Tokyo rig. Um, you can even throw this on a shaky head, a Carolina rig if you want. Just a super cool worm there from Magnum Baits. All right, ledge season, about to be on fire all across the country. So now is the time you guys wanna stock up and get some ledge fishing stuff. So the first one here, this is from Striking. This is the Mark Rose Little Ledge Spoon. So this came out last year at ICAST, and it, every time we just get a few of them in stock, they go right out the door to all the people that had them on back order since last summer. We finally just got a batch of them in stock, and they're ready to go. We have all the colors in stock, so if you're trying to pick these up, you want to get them now before they're sold out again. So this little ledge spoon, it's one ounce. It's a small spoon, and it's got a little bit different shape than just your standard, you know, just straight-bodied spoons that are jigging spoons out there on the market. It's got that S shape to it, and it's got that wide section right there in the belly. So that gives it a really great fluttering action, and it'll actually dart away from you every once in a while, and you get a little bit, you know, that it goes right back towards the, the fish. So you get a little bit different action, and that when it scoots away from you, that's when it triggers a lot of bites. Some of the other cool features on it is it has, they have awesome paint jobs, 3D eyes, they have scales molded into the lead. Um, one of the cool things too is they have a swivel built into the head, so you don't have to add a swivel to it, and it's gonna reduce all that line twist that you get when you don't have a swivel, and it's gonna reduce a lot of leverage too whenever you get a fish hooked up. Ready to go right out of the box, got a KVD, a KVD EWG treble hook on there, so you're gonna keep fish pinned, and it's a 2X strong hook, so you're gonna keep them locked up. You're not gonna have to worry about bending it out with this little spoon, so when everyone's out there with those big, eight, nine inch spoons and uh, you know, giant crankbaits and stuff like that. You just want a smaller, com more compact profile, show them something just a little bit smaller, check out a little lead spoon. All right, another cool bait that we just got from True Bass. So this is the True Bass 
BA spinnerbait. So this spinnerbait was designed by a full-time guide and BFL angler, uh, Brent Anderson. So this has been kind of a secret they've been keeping out on the TVA system for a long time. So they've been fishing this bait for a long time and now they're finally releasing it to the public. So, you know, hot lead secret out there for the summertime. So this spinnerbait is an ounce and a quarter in weight. And as you can see, you know, it's got your, your standard, you know, will, it's got a willow leaf blade on there. It's actually a stamped willow leaf blade on a ball bearing swivel. So that's just awesome feature right there in itself. And then you have these four wires, four small flexible wires coming out of the head with these four little willow blades on there. So you're just gonna get a tremendous amount of flash and vibration and you're almost gonna get that profile of an umbrella rig, but in a more compact, you know, package like a spinnerbait. It's got, you know, the, the main frame is real stout wire, so you don't have to worry about bending it out. You can throw it on 20 pound line, not have to worry about it. It's got a, you know, super stout six aught hook on there. Got a nice keeper on there if you want to add a swim bait to it. But again, just, you know, something different. It's not a full size umbrella rig. It's, you know, more than just a regular spinner bait. So you're just getting a different look and action that uh, the fish haven't seen before. So this is gonna be definitely something you want to throw out on the ledges this summer. All right, last ledge fishing stuff we got. So from, from Ledge Hog Bait Supply. So we just got five new colors of their blade bait. And these are all the Buddy Gross series colors. So the first two here, my favorite, they're kind of kind of thread fin shad color, colors. We got the winning shad right here. And then we got his denim shad. Next up, the two next colors are kind of more your dirty water colors. If you're looking for something a little bit brighter, we got Buddy Gross's Limeade. And then we got the grunge shad. So real, you know, chartreuse and black. So if it's real dirty, that's gonna be one to go, one to go for. And then last up, we got the, uh, the slate shad. So just the, you know, perfect bait fish imitation, you know, black back, white belly. It's got some sparkle to it. Um, all these baits come with EWG trebles on them. They, and all the colors come in all three sizes of the, uh, of the ledge hog blade bait. So it comes in the three inch, five, three inch, four inch, and five inch. These are the big five inch ones. I believe they weigh like three and a half ounces, so you can throw these things a mile. Doesn't matter how much wind is in the air. I've actually used them when, you know, you can cast in a 20 mile an hour headwind and they fly and empty your spool. It's awesome. Um, they have the five position on the top as well, so you can adjust the vibration and for the different depth zones that you're fishing on these blade baits. So, you know, they come standard on the number two hole. So that's kind of the most universal, great for deep water, great for fishing up shallow. But if you go all the way down to the, to the rear, um, that, that will give you a, a full waking action. You wouldn't think, you know, a five inch bait that weighs over three ounces, you can wake on the surface, but you put on that black bit, that, that back hole right there, and you can wake this thing right across the surface and get some great strikes out of it. So just already an awesome bait and just added five new awesome colors from Buddy Gross that he designed to the lineup. All right, thanks for tuning in to this week's episode of What's New Attack Warehouse. For more information on the purchase product seen here today, make sure to click shop for the link in the description below. If you enjoyed this week's video, Make sure to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel, let us know in the comments which one of these products you're most pumped about.